The latest from the rumor mill is just in, and AMD's flagship big navi part, probably named the RX 5950 XT, will supposedly have 80 CUs. And this is the GPU that is purportedly to be an NVIDIA killer and will put AMD back on the map for high-end graphics. Now keep in mind that this video is a rumor, and as rumors go, keep those salt shakers handy. ADCU should translate to 5,120 stream processors if AMD maintains its 64 stream processor to 1 CU ratio, and the architecture is thought to be based on RDNA 2. Now, since the card has more than 40 CUs, it's clear that the architecture in question is RDNA. According to the source, this is RDNA 2 which means native support for hardware-based ray tracing. AMD has already pledged support for this cause, and we think that we will be seeing this pop up in their next generation of graphics cards. Now keep in mind that we are not sure at this point whether the ADCU card is the RX 5950 or the RX 5800 series or any of the other variants mentioned in the EEC filing, and we would hazard a guess that this is indeed the flagship. Now, ADCU should translate again to 5,100 stream processors, and if AMD is able to run these at a minimum of 1,700 megahertz, you're looking at an astounding 17.5 teflops of power. Now, considering this is 7 nanometer, AMD should easily be able to hit that unless they run into TDP constraints, although you're still looking at quite a steep power draw of somewhere in the ballpark of 300 watts. For more on this and other news, follow the link in the description and make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that we don't miss you in the next one.